Hallelujah, glory to God. You are welcome to Prophetic Intercession with Amel. If this is the first time you are seeing me, you are welcome to this channel. Thank you so much for stopping by. Please kindly consider becoming a part of us by subscribing and turning on your notification bell. So that whenever we are live, you are going to be the first to know. Hallelujah. This is crazy. Someone cursed you, even though you did nothing wrong to them. They released a curse on you. And probably you know about this or you do not know about it. Maybe you know about it and you're so worried. You're asking yourself, what do I do to break that curse? And maybe you do not know about it. But I came here with a good news for you. You do not have to worry. If, some, if you do something wrong to someone and they curse you, you can, you know, go and ask for forgiveness. You can apologize. You can try to make things right. But what if you do nothing and they are just cursing you out of wickedness? or jealousy, or pure evil. What do you do about it? The Lord gave me a prophetic word for you. It's coming from the book of Proverbs chapter 26 and verse 2. Proverbs 26 and verse 2. It says, like the sparrow in her wandering, like the swallow in her flying. So the curse without cause doesn't come and light, doesn't come and alight for, doesn't come and alight on the, on the on deserving King James version says a curse a costless curse will not stand this one I am reading is the amplified version of the bible it tries to be more explicit it says like the sparrow in the wandering like the swallow in her flying so so the curse without cause does not come and alight on the undeserving it means it will not happen you, you do not deserve to be cursed so it will not happen to you because you did nothing wrong. So do not be, as, do not be scared if someone actually uh, 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 cursed you when you did nothing wrong. Do not fret. Do not worry. It will not stand. You did nothing wrong. Do not, do not panic. They want you to panic and do things that you're not supposed to do. It's okay. Keep your calm. Put yourself together. A, cur a causeless curse doesn't have any ground. Hallelujah. Father, I pray for your son and your daughter to keep them in perfect peace in the name of Jesus. I pray that you give the, them the assurance that a curseless curse over their life would not stand in Jesus' mighty name. Amen.